Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Emily. And I'm Eden. And, and welcome, welcome to Bash, Bash TV. TV. Today is Thursday, February 23rd, making today the official 109th day of school and day one of the cycle. Juniors, there will be a brief class meeting in the auditorium today at the beginning of period seven. Attention seniors, the yearbook is looking for pictures of the following. Seniors in their college, seniors in their pets, and seniors in their rides. Submit your photos to Miss Mowry by March 10th. Seniors, be sure to check your school email for senior award information. Questions, email Mrs. Curry or your school counselor. Seniors, are you still searching for the perfect college? If you're interested in applying to Penn West, California, Clarion, or Edinburgh, all application fees are waived during the month of February. You can apply through Common App through February 28th. Seniors, Keystone College is hosting a FAFSA completion and instant decision night on March 1st from 5.30 to 8 p.m. For more information or to register, can the QR code outside of the guidance office. Seniors, two scholarship opportunities are available through the FCFP Philanthropy Center. Visit the website below for more information or apply. Congratulations to the following students who auditioned and have been accepted into the PMEA Region 4 All-State Chorus to be held in Williamsport this week. Jasper Martinez, Carly Kyle, Regan Welch, Anna Reinheimer, and Christopher Stola. Congratulations also to Reagan Smith and Jack Hendren, who were the first runners-up. The concert is this Friday at the Williamsport Community Arts Center at 7 p.m. Well, that's it for me. Now let's send it over to FYI. Thanks, Eden and Emily. Welcome to FYI, where we explore what's happening around school. SAT is collecting used towels, blankets, sheets, etc. until Friday for pets helping vets in Benton. Any donations can be dropped off in the library. There will be a debate club meeting in Mr. Godden's room today at 2.40 p.m. The Central Susquehanna Intermediate Unit was awarded a grant to pay for students' training called SYNC. This stands for Supporting Your Needs in Community Healthcare. This career field is new and emerging. SYNC assists with tuition, training, work support, certificate and career services, and SYNC provides multiple financial stipends for completing the certification process. Sign up in the guidance office to learn how you can kick off your career after graduation on March 7th at 10 a.m. in the in room 45. Well, that's it for FYI. Let's head over to sports with Sean. Thanks, Percy. I'm Sean, and welcome to sports. If you play sports and want to have a quote in the sports section of the yearbook, check your student email for a Google form sent by Ms. Mowry. Track and field signups are now available in the guidance office. The first practice will be Monday, March 6th at the Varsity Gym. A reminder to all students that a physical is required to participate. On Tuesday in sports, the girls' basketball team fell just short in their first-round playoff game at Valley View with a final score of 56-43. to Rachel White Knight scored a game high of 24 points. Now let's check out today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Caitlin Allen and Olivia Temple. Well, that's it for Bash TV. Have a great day, BHS. <laughs>